first fail on day three, and he weighed in a 36.1 kg amberjack. And the smile on his face told me that he thought he had won the compo. And two minutes later, his bubble was burst when young Matt de Philippi weighed a amberjack of 39.4, but we'll get to that just now. Fantastic young angler, Matt de Philippi, an amberjack of 39.4, brilliant fish, on a boat called About Time on the third day. He wins this beautiful 525 Cobra Cat Center Consul Ski Boat by Mallows. Matthew, what an awesome prize to win! Yeah, I'm so happy. <laughs> Tommy, how long did it take you to fight the fish? Um, it took us about 15 minutes. Yeah, it wasn't a, too much of a long fight because we're trying to pull it fast so it doesn't cut us off on the reef. So we got to get it off the bottom very quick. So now tell me, you're not quite old enough yet to drive this. Were well, you going to have to park it for a while? When are you doing your skippers? I'm going to do my skippers this year because I'm 16 now, turning 17 in late July. But uh, we might probably going to keep this one and my dad's going to have to launch it for us. <laughs> Is there space in dad's garage to park it? <laughs> you have to stay in the yard, you have to cover it up. <laughs> yep. You're not going to throw the old man's boat out and put yours in? <laughs> No, we'll see. <laughs> well done, Matthew. Brilliant. Well done. See? Thanks. Thanks a lot. <laughs> Anton? The end of the Mallards for 2015. A surprise fish pulled it off this year. Tell us about it. Oh, we had a fantastic bonanza this, uh, this week. Uh, 2015 has probably been uh, the best year of our fishing down at the south coast. Uh, some awesome fish came out. Not a lot of fish came out, but the fish that did come out were quality sized fish. They're really that uh, people overseas and anywhere in the world would love to be able to angle uh, these type of fish. And of course, the youngster that won tonight, uh, Matthew de Filippi, uh, he's 16 years old. And to bring out a, a, a 39 kg fish like that is awesome. It really is. I, I personally, I was talking about it today. There's no way that I could uh, be able to wheel a, a fish like that up. So yeah, to this youngster, well done. He's uh, got an awesome boat and uh, he's now taking his father's footsteps and uh, yeah the rest of it was good and I'm, I'm, I'm very glad that everybody enjoyed themselves and they had a good week here we had no fatalities no one heard no one saw the skippers did well so yes at the end of the day I think uh, the most part of it the best part of it is it enriched the south coast to bringing people to the realization that the south coast is a wonderful destination to come to. Especially for fishing. Now tell us about this fish that he pulled out. The, the amberjack that he caught today is not an easy fish to catch. It, uh, it takes a bit of time to get it. And I'll tell you what, when that thing gets onto your line, you've got a hard job. You've got to, you take about uh, probably 20 minutes to get it, to see it, if you're lucky. And then it goes back down and uh, it plays down on the bottom for another half an hour or so and then you might see it in another hour and that fish can take you up to two to three hours to catch. They would have probably been uh, using a 120 pound uh, line on that fish and uh, which is a heavy tackle and if you take 120 pound which is a uh, um, you know, 60, 60 kg line basically uh, and that fish only weighed uh, you know, close to 40 uh, should have broken the line but at the same time it's such a magnificent fish the angling side of it he was able to bring it back so it's an awesome fish I mean people don't they, people go over to New Zealand to catch fish like that where we got it in our own backyard here in Shelly Beach but quite difficult to catch and well done to our young 16 year old absolutely and uh, I always said to him uh, if he had uh, become in the provincial side of it he would probably be one of the top provincial anglers we've got now. And that, short, that fishing competition starts shortly as well? Uh, yes, we got um, next week on the 
starting on the 20th of uh, July, we got the Junior Nationals that have been held here at Shelly Beach at the, at the Ski Boat Club. And we got 20 teams. We got uh, 10 under 19 sides and we got 10 under 16 sides. So, yeah, it's, uh, I hope they're going to have the same uh, week that we had here now with the fish, which I think they will. I mean, uh, these kids know how to fish. They, they all selected from their provinces, from their, uh, the different provinces from all over the country. And it's the cream of the crop. So, yeah, I think we'll have a good week. So exciting times for us just around the corner. Anton, thank you very much. Thank you for seeing us through this competition as well. Thank you. Oh, thank you very much for being here. Thank you.